to rise and shine. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I hope you're feeling fine. The sun is just above the hill. Another day for us to fill with all the things we love to do. Oh, can't you hear? It's calling you. I put vanilla in my tea this morning. Um, just black tea. I made like a latte type thing. Why? Why did nobody tell me to put vanilla in my tea before? If you knew and you didn't tell me, shame on you. Holding out on me. Secrets. Secrets are no good for anybody. I put vanilla in my tea this morning because I thought, hey, let's be a little extra. It's so good. It's so yummy. Vanilla in my tea. Ooh. 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 Yes. Put vanilla in your tea. It's delicious. I'm making a lunch. It's 1.52. I get the chicken, it's a steam, okay? And I put in uh, garlic salt and uh, minced onion in a bag, stir fry blend, Dollar Tree. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm, lots of veggies, lots of veggies. Oh, frozen on there. And then, and then I cover, cover for more steam. Then season, all-purpose Greek season. Yeah. Okay, time go by. Five minutes, yeah? Okay, now, lid off, mix and mix. Mix. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Cut chicken if want. I don't. Okay. Now, seasoning. More Greek. Put, not more Greek. Put Greek seasoning or season of choice. I use Greek seasoning. Some tasty yum yum season lots 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 okay good mixy mix mm -hmm. flip chicken okay flip chicken season other side yes 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 okay mm. cover three minutes Okay, on plate, extra, extra juice from pan, make gravy, flour, one spoon, one spoon flour, yeah, sprinkle, sprinkle, mixy whisk, okay, whisk, where's whisk, there's whisk, hmm, whiskey whisk, make sure pan on, otherwise no blend. Okay, thicken, thicken, pan gravy, AKA pan reduction sauce, uh, whatever. Ooh, thickness, look gross, taste good. Okay, look it, I show you, here it is. See, like say, look gross, taste good. Put on chicken. Add more water if want not so thick. And done. Okay. Remember to clean up pan. Food look pretty, taste good. Let's try it. Mmm. Scrum jazz. Back to work. I learned a new saying, phrase, whatever today. I had no idea it is actually something people say. It is in an old Indian English. Now, I don't know if that means Indian from India or Indian as a native English phrase, but it is Please do the needful. Do the needful. It sounds wrong. 
in American English language, but apparently it's correct. In Indian English language, basically just means please do what is needed. Do the needful. I had never in my almost 40 years of existence ever heard do the needful. Never heard it. It sounds weird. Like it does not sound like proper grammar. You know what I mean? Uh, but apparently it is. It's a phrase that is used and uh, it's apparently used enough times to create memes. Like if you were to Google meme do the need blah, 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 do the needful memes you'll you'll get a bunch like a whole bunch and they're actually kind of funny but do the needful please do the needful it just sounds strange ow different obviously strange different something i had never heard but apparently, like I said, it's not wrong. I guess, you know, I, it was just a fax. I'm coming through this fax and I got so distracted by the phrase, please do the needful, that I had to figure out what the heck that meant. Well, I actually, I messaged it in my group chat and somebody else figured out what it meant because it just sounds so weird you know what i mean it just sounds odd uh, do the needful i guess i'm doing the needful as far as my hair goes right now it's nice get it really good and combed brushed out i like it nice and brushed out really good thinking about getting it relaxed, but I don't want to do that because that will ruin my hair texture again, or more. This is not my towel. I have this towel, it's very big and fluffy. Big fluffy towels. I like big fluffy towels. cotton I'm pretty sure I don't know I didn't buy this towel it was a gift let's see uh yep 100% cotton that's nice for me 100% cotton cotton is fabric of our lives except it's not I don't even think a lot of things are made out of cotton anymore I've never heard of anyone having a cotton allergy, but it's got to exist. And I think that would be really terrible to have a cotton allergy. You know what is funny? I think it's funny. Some things people are afraid of. I think it's funny, but that's just me. You know, is it mean if I say that? I think your phobia is funny. People have phobias of cotton balls. Cotton balls, of course, and I also think trypophobia, which is a fear of holes, is funny. But then there are also people who have, um, I don't remember what it's called, but it's a fear of teeth. So they, they either pluck, pluck out, they pull out their own teeth, or they just, they don't brush their teeth. And they get like the fuzz. It's plaque, obviously, because they're so afraid of their teeth, they can't even look at them. So they probably just like all the time. So they can't see their teeth. And they probably don't like that. You know what I mean? I gotta pee. Good evening. Time to do the dishes. Well, that's done. Now, time to clean off the island. All better. Now, time for the kitchen table. Now that the table's clean, let's 
take out garbage and recycle. Garbage and recycle are empty. I don't have enough room for those boxes. Those will have to get broken down and put in next week. So, how about we empty the beer? Okay, draining the water. Beer is in the fridge. I think it's time to put away coats. The coats we do use, I left out. Because, why would you want to put them back, take them out, put them back, put them away? It's like, nobody wants to do that. So I left them out. All right. Uh, other than that cooler, these boxes, that table goes into my room. I have cleaned my kitchen. Tidied my kitchen. It's not, I didn't clean anything. I tidied it. Which is much better than it was before. Why did the raven get kicked out of the tavern? Because it was a crowbar. And thus concludes the bad jokes of the evening. Have yourself a good night and tomorrow is Thursday. Toodles. Thank you.